Hello, good evening. Hi. Oh, I can see your video. Hello, good evening. I can I cannot see your video. Can you open your video? Yes, can you open your video and also your mic? Okay, hello. Oh, I cannot hear you. I cannot hear you. Okay. Hello. Hello. Good evening. This is my son. Oh. Yes. Good evening, ma'am. Yes. Oh. Hello. How are you tonight? Yes. I don't know. Yes, how are you tonight? Mm -hmm. Oh, you're good. By the way, may I know your name? Um, my full name is um, uh, Dang. And how will I call you? Uh, you can call me Mix. Yeah, is that Mix? Yes. Okay, mix. Okay, good evening, mix. So, by the way, I am teacher Macon, your teacher for tonight. Okay, by the way, I am teacher Megan is 26 years old. How about you? Yes. Are you high school, right? Yes. Oh, um, let me guess. Are you are you thirteen years old? Um, I'm what? twelve. Ah, twelve. Oh, yeah, you're twelve years old. Because in the Philippines, if it's grade eight, it's already thirteen. Okay. By the way, how was your day? How was your day there? Are you going somewhere? No. Or are you just staying inside your house? Uh, can you repeat? How, how, what are you doing for the whole day? Are you going somewhere? Or just stay in the house? Are you just staying in the house? Yes, I'm staying. In oh, my house. you're staying in your house, and you also have online class in your school. Mm. Yes, you have it. You have online class in your school. online class like you will have online class you will not go to school you will just uh you will just face on the laptop and talk to the teacher are you doing that one like what we are doing now yes are you doing it oh great okay so before we will start Okay, teacher wants to know what is where are you schooling? Where are you schooling? Um, can you are you what's the name of your school? You know what is a school, right? Oh yeah, yeah. What's the name of your school? Name. How will you call your school? Uh, my school name. Is what? Uh, what's your name of your school? Because teacher wants um, to know. 
Yeah. Yeah. High school names as dạng võ has secondary school. Oh. It's from grade one to high school, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. By the way, teacher also wants to know what are your hobbies? What are your things um, you want to do? Uh, my hobby is playing video games. Oh, video games. What else? Playing video games. How about... Aside from that, out, outdoor hobbies like outdoor sports. Are you fond of those? Outdoor, you will play with your friends. Are you or who are, who are those? Are you doing that one else? Oh, you're playing with your friends. And what are those hobbies that you will play together with your friends? Mix. Okay, what are those? Can you just share one to teacher? Okay. How about going somewhere? Mm, okay. I mean, what are your outdoor hobbies like basketball? Do you know how to play basketball? No, I'm, uh, I like playing soccer. Oh, wow. Soccer. Teacher don't know how to play that. That's great because he have that hobby. Okay, how about how many are you in your family also? Can teacher know about your family? How many are you? Are you alone? I mean, only one? Or you have a lot of siblings, or brother, or sisters? Uh, uh, I have sisters. Oh, you have sisters. And how many brothers? Only one? It's you? Uh, uh, I don't have brother. Oh, you're the one, the only son. And you have two sisters? Uh, uh, one. Ah, oh, one sister and you. Oh, that's a small family. Okay, so before you all start, once again, good evening. And I'll do my share screen for our lesson tonight. Okay, are you ready? Okay, I'll do my share screen. Okay, can you see my screen? Yes. Okay, so welcome to Pantada's class. So tonight, we will have speaking test. Okay, speaking. So I want you to speak. All right. Okay. So there you are. Okay, before that, I'm going to want to ask you something. Okay. Are you fond of studying languages in your spare time? Oh, languages. Are you fond of studying languages if in your free time? Like other language. What are the, by the way, before that, what are the languages that you speak? You speak English. English. Okay, that's great. Aside from English, what else? Uh, um, mm. uh, I don't know. Uh, Vietnamese. You're speaking also Vietnamese, right? Mm, yeah. Yeah, there's another language, Vietnamese, la English. What else aside from the two? Only two? Yeah? Mm. Uh, do you speak it's always? Good. What? Yes. What will you say? Spanish. Oh, you Spanish? Uh, uh, yes. Wow. You know how to speak Spanish? Teacher don't know. Just very few. Can you give me an example? Oh, try to speak with me in Spanish. Oh. Um, uh, uh, I just started um, uh, learning Spanish. 
Ah, you start learning Spanish. Do you have also an online class with Spanish? Mm. Are you? Oh, wow, that's so nice. So very good because you're studying with the different languages. Oh, I have here another question. Why is it, oh, why is it important that you will learn a lot of languages? Oh, uh, yes, Mix. Uh, you learn more languages like English, Spanish, Vietnamese, or any Japanese or any languages that you want. Why are you, why are you interested to learn? Oh, uh, yeah. What um, what is your purpose or reason why you learn you want to learn? How oh, mm, you want to what's the first one? Can you give me one reason? Uh, what do you think? Um, oh yes. What's your reason? Okay, you maybe you want to communicate with other people in the other country, right? Because you know what? You're from Vietnam and teacher is from the Philippines. So we can communicate because we both speak English. So that's why we need to learn a lot of languages. Okay. Another one is how often do you meet friends and go out? Oh, do you have a lot of friends? Yes, uh, Mix? Yes. Oh, you have your barcadas or closest friends with you? Yeah? Um, not often. Oh, you have close friends. I mean, how about close friend and best friend? Do you have a best friend also? Mm, yes. Oh yeah, then you will go out outing or going somewhere with your best friends or close friends. Are you doing that one? Outing or going somewhere? Um, um. How about before? Before COVID time, since COVID, so we cannot go somewhere easily. Mm -hmm. Before, when you were still in grade seven, are you grade eight, right? If if you I'm are. not wrong, you are. Uh, you, you are grade eight, right? <laughs> grade eight, are you? I mean, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So this time, are you all? Are you also fond of going to cinema with friends? Do you like watching movies or oh, anime movies? Do you like? Oh, yes, you like it also. And do you have you experienced going to cinema with your friends? With, with your friends and any, anyone? Yeah. Um, um, my girlfriend. Oh, your again, your girlfriend. Yeah. Oh yeah. How about your friends? Are we together with your friends or just alone with your girlfriend? Uh, just alone. Oh wow, that's great. Okay, so. That so we will have interaction about your friends. Okay. So this time, can you see my screen? Okay. Can you see my screen? Here are useful language. Okay. So, like in making questions, making questions, we will ask how about and what should be your response? You know what should be the response to suggestion? When I will ask, how about? Your response should be, that is a good idea. Most of the response. Another one, what about this? Or what about that idea? So, what about this food? Do you like that food? Oh, it's just an example. 
So you can have also a wristband. Wow, that's that's so yummy food. Oh. You can have a lot of making questions like why, right? Okay, I want you to choose one out from the example of making questions. Choose one there and try to make a sentence out from it. Is it okay with you? Yes. Okay, choose there, just one. Okay, in here, just, it is the first statement. Is it how about you want to choose? Okay, any what about, let's, why don't we or cat or could? Uh, which one you gonna choose? Choose one and try to create a question out from that. Okay? All right, I'll give you two seconds to do that. Okay. Okay, do you have an idea there? How about going to the cinema? Oh, what again? Yes. Okay, mm. okay. Mm, how about playing football? Okay, very good. How about playing football? So it could be, wow, that's a good idea, Mix. Okay, very good. You're so smart. Okay, so that is some of the way you're going to make a questions. And another one, how you will respond to the question. Okay, that's so great. So another one also, there are also useful languages for discussing an alternatives. You know what is an alter alternatives? You know what's this word here? Alternatives. You know what's that word? Oh, uh, what is um is that word familiar to you? Yes, mix. Yes. Uh, what is alternatives for you? Okay, so we can also have another languages to discuss alternatives like, for example, which do you think is the best? So you will look for something, for something that is an alternative. So which do you think is the best? Oh, that's another example. How about the second one, alternatives? Can you read that? Okay. Okay, mix. The second one is? Yes, that's possible. Okay, yes, that's possible. So you can help also, that's a good alternative. So it is difficult to decide, but so there's the first phrase of the sentence if you want to discuss an alternatives. Like another one also, I think it is more useful because this is like this. So you can explain why it's very useful and you can also discuss the things why is it useful. Another one also is it would be better to. So it will be the beginning or the first phrase. Then you can continue. Okay. So another also for asking for opinions. Okay. So when we talk about opinions, like for example, which ones will ask you? Is it okay? So what is your opinion towards the COVID virus nowadays? 
uh, what's your opinions or your stand? You know what is an opinion, right? Okay, Mix, what is your opinion about it? Yeah, what what do you think? Yeah. Any any idea about it? Uh, what is your opinion about the things that happen with regards to the COVID virus? Oh, COVID-19. You have it right also there. Same here. Okay, what is your idea? Do you have any opinion towards it? Oh, oh Giselle, can you share it to me? Okay. Yes. How like are you? Do you like about how the government respond to it or any idea about it? With regards to, okay. With regards to the, this one. Okay. Can you read that? Okay, with regards to that, any idea? Okay. Oh, how you feel. How you feel that you will just stay always or most of the time in the house. You can go, but there are a lot of protocols you can follow. Okay, what do you think? Are you happy or any any feeling that you want to share? Uh, for me, uh, COVID nineteen is a disaster with many people. Uh, uh lots of people uh died from COVID nineteen. Oh yeah, there are a lot of people died about it and hoping that it will end so that no more disaster and no more problem that we will face and we can do the things that we want to do like going somewhere with nothing to have fear, right? Okay, so we hope that. So another one also, another useful languages for giving opinions like I think, right? I guess you're using that one. I think, okay, you can have that's another opinion or I could have, I say. Another one also is, I'm pretty sure that, oh. So I am pretty sure that most of the people, there are very sad of what's happening around the world, okay? And how about how you will express preferences? Okay, there are examples, the three examples there. Can you read those three examples? Yes. Okay, the first statement. Uh, okay, the first there is. Oh. Uh, the three express preferences, how you will express your outlook or your preferences there. So the first there is, what's this? Okay, that those are the first statement Then you will just add inputs in it, okay? So those are I'll do rather, I prefer to, and I'll like. Again, what are those three? The three are? I like. Okay. I prefer to and I like. Okay. So can you choose their one example? I mean, choose their one statement, the first statement, and try to create, uh, express an example of preferences. How will you, 
how well you express it. Okay? Uh, which of the three there you want to choose? Okay, in here. Which of the three you want to choose there? Okay, mix. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, ready? Um, yeah, okay, you're ready. So which one there you chose? Okay, uh, is it uh, three. Okay, you choose I'll do rather. Okay, can you give me a sample of using that one? Um, I'd rather stay at home than Then you would rather stay home than what? Mm -hmm. Then, oh, uh, okay. Just continue, teacher will wait for you. All right, I'd rather stay home rather, I'd rather stay home than Oh, you staying outside, going somewhere. Okay. Oh, going somewhere. So you want to just stay home. By the way, who's, who's with you and staying there in your home? Are you with your family every day? Yes. Are you with your family every day there? Yes. Okay, very good. So you have an idea there. So do you have any questions about it? All right, so no questions. So there you are. Okay, so you know what? Some parents want to start an activities club that teenagers could go to after school. Oh, do you have any extracurricular before, when you were still grade seven, I guess, because no school this year, face to face. So, do you have any extra curricular after your school, like activity clubs? Do you have in school with the different clubs that you want to join? Okay, do you have any school activities in your school before? Like English club or athletics club or any clubs that you have in school? Do you have like that? Yes, mix, like in the picture. Oh, yes. uh, yeah. Uh, what, I like school. What club you, or activity club that you joined before? Playing chess. Oh, wow. You're so great. So you're good in math. Oh, you're playing that oh, board games. Okay, that's nice. What else? How about playing basketball with your friends? You have also a basketball club? Mm, no, I don't like basketball. Okay, how about this one? Painting. Oh, painting something we have also. Have you tried to join those? Uh, okay. Oh, this one, this one is you like most. Oh, playing chess. Oh, that's so nice. How about this one? Computer. Oh video games 
I guess you like it also. That's your hobby, one of your hobby, right? You all yeah. watch videos and playing playing computer games. Are you playing computer games, right? <clears throat> yes. How about watching racing or any competition with regards to motorcycle or any vehicle? Are you doing that one also? So that you can enjoy your day, you're doing that? Yes, Mix? No. Ah, uh, no. Okay. So there are a lot of activity club in school or even not really, I mean, uh, not related to school. So which of, can you choose one there that you really experience most? You experience most, and can you share it to me? When was that, or what's the best thing happened the time with that activity club? Okay, just choose one there. Choose which one there that you that is very that is an unforgettable experience with you. It means you cannot forget that experience. Okay, what what is that? Mm. And also uh, you, yeah. Chess. Ah, oh, playing chess. Wow, that's so nice. So, how was that experience playing chess with your? Who's that? That someone. Why is it playing chess? Oh, why you chose that one? Okay. I chose that. Oh, what the why do you think? Okay. Uh, why you chose that one? Why you select that, this one? Because is it interactive for you? Or it will be challenging for you? It will be challenged when you do chess game. Oh, how do you feel like that? Very nice. Okay, what again? Mm. Oh, is it and very interesting to you? Yes. Oh, yes. Okay, that's why you chose that. It's very nice experience also. So there you are. So are you also fan of playing basketball? So I guess just a little. How about learning arts and how to draw? That's what we discussed a while ago. Watching TV films. Playing musical instruments. How about musical instruments? You know how to play one of the musical instruments? Like drum, guitar, or any musical instrument that you know? Yes, Mix, you want, you know? Okay. Yeah. No, I, okay. no, I don't. Okay. Yeah, so you love board games. Okay, another one is using computers. And I know you're so great on that. Another one is playing board games, which you like most. Okay, and dancing. How about dancing? Are you fun of dancing also? Mm, I find uh, dancing uh, um, uh, is kind, of, kind of boring. Oh, dancing. Okay, you really don't like. So you like more on board games or computer. Okay, that's your hobby that you like. Okay, so this time, I want you to describe people or places. Uh, you will say something about people or places saying where people and things 
are and what people are doing. Okay, I have here a question mix. Can you tell the teacher the, the most oh, valuable people in your life? person in your life important person in your life oh yeah can you share it teacher who is the most important person in your life yes uh what do you have oh uh, do you have uh, someone my mom Oh, your mom. Okay. And can you describe your mom for being an important person in your life? Oh, it's your mom. Very good. Why is it your mom? Oh, just give me at least one reason. Okay. My mom bring up me. Oh, your mom bringing you. Ah, very good. At the same time, she also support you. Okay, that's great. So, that's it. Great, Max. So, this time, I'll show you a picture. Okay, can you see the picture there? Can you see the picture? Yes. Okay, that's great. So this is an example of the sentence that would be based on the picture, okay? That is at the top. Can you see the top there? This one in the mouse at the top, at the bottom, at the right, at the left, in the middle, the background, in the foreground. So in the middle there is a woman who might be a teacher. Oh, there is a woman there looking after the children oh you see that in the foreground we can see two children who are studying hard oh they're really studying hard so what i want you to do is try to describe the picture okay try to describe and observe the picture for one minute okay and I want to ask you something about it. All right. Is it clear? Okay, I'll give you time to, to familiarize the face of the picture. Top, bottom, and everything. Okay? Okay, time starts now. Okay, is Mix ready? Okay, are you ready? No, not yet. Oh, not yet. Okay. Okay, you can also use this. So you need to describe everything you see in the picture for one minute and you can talk about, the, for example, the picture is very busy, the people are wearing like this and like that. You can talk also what they are doing, okay? 
what objects you can see in the picture, what are the things that surround, okay? And how people are using them, what are they using? All right, that's, that's an idea. Okay, Mix, are you ready? Okay, I'll go back to the picture now. Okay, there you are. Okay. Yes, mix. Are you ready? Okay, 10 seconds left. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Okay, time's up. All right, I guess Mix is very ready, okay? Can you tell me your opinion about the things you can see in the picture? You can use the phrases or the statement we had a while ago. You can apply it, okay? Oh, can you tell it to teacher now? What are the things you see? or the things you can describe in the picture. Okay, can you show it to me? Oh yeah. Okay, Max. Oh, by the way, can you hear me? Yes, can you hear me? Yeah. Okay, so are you ready now? Okay, I'll... Ready? How about show me your video? Okay, teacher wants to see your video. Okay, are you ready? Oh, time starts now. Okay, I'll give you... It's your turn to speak. Say something about those there in the picture. Okay. Go, Max. Okay. Yes. Oh, you can have clue here. You can use it's a the picture. It is a picture of a very busy classroom. Another clue: What are they wearing? What are they doing? What objects you can see in the picture, and how people are using them. Those are the clue with with what you will describe in the picture, okay? Go, Max. All right. Ready? Yes, ready? Okay, what can you say and what can you describe there? Can you describe something? You know what this describe? Uh, can you, what you can tell 
face at the looking at the picture. Oh, are they busy? Oh, are they in the classroom? Oh yeah, what do you think? Go mix. Yeah? Uh, just give me at least two. Two sentences based on the picture. Okay? Okay, what do you think? All right. Okay. Try to describe. Already? Okay, again. The people. Oh, what are the people doing? Are they right? Oh, what are the people doing there? Um, uh, yes, oh yeah what else how about the other people on the other side what are they doing like or the inside of the classroom how what will you what will you say about the inside is it what can you say what can you describe what can you describe like the picture the color oh what is uh, just one more okay mix just one go mix i know you can do that Oh, look at uh, teacher will try to encircle. So I'm going to give you a clue. All right. So there you are. How about those people here? Can you see what are they doing? How about the people in here and the other in the in front? Okay. What are they doing? I know you have an idea. Just share it to me. Okay, one more, one more. Pichu wants to ask one more from you. Okay? Okay. All right, so what is it? Mm, they are using computers. Oh yeah, very good. They're using computers. They're making something out using the technologies. Okay, some are using paper and pen and the others are sketching. Okay, good job, Max. Okay, that's so great. By the way, do you have any questions about tonight? Do you have any questions? Any questions that you want to ask the teacher about the things we discussed tonight? Yes. Uh, what is your question? Uh, do you have how are you? Uh, what again? How old are you? Oh, oh, I'm so great. Oh, you're asking how am I? Yes. Yeah. yeah, I'm so great here. Oh, same staying in the house despite of the COVID. Okay. So I hope you learned something for tonight. And I guess that will be all for tonight, Mix. So thank you for tonight and bye-bye. Mm, thank you.
Okay, thank you so much and bye-bye. Okay, keep safe there.